top signs you're a mystic person number 1 you see the bigger picture like a small cog in a big machine mystics realize that they are a small but integral part of life they see from a higher perspective in approaching life realizing that they are one with all that is as they aim to align themselves and their actions with that of the highest good number 2 understand that the importance of forgiveness kindness and letting go it's not easy for many to forgive let go cater to the need of others before oneself but in the case of mystic it isn't that hard to understand that the whole essence of a peaceful existence is to let go to forgive and to impart kindness to all that you meet in your life it's a good karma that paves way for our soul's journey and mystics understand that number 3 you purify your soul of attachments because you now know that trying to cling to the very transitory nature of life is a cause of great suffering you don't cling onto anyone or anything you love people you love the world around you and all that it holds but you don't create attachments basically you live in the world but you are not of the world you have a loss of interest in competition You realize that competition brings suffering and conflict and that the only way to live in harmony with others is by having a compassionate and loving attitude towards them. Your wisdom is your own. The things you know, you know them for your soul. Your wisdom is your own. Your wisdom does not come from what others have spoken or written, but rather from deep within yourself. You can see it through people. You might be hanging out with a new friend who seems charming or out on a date. However, your intuition is totally on point if you can see through the fake smiles. You didn't fit in with children your age. A mystic is not as absorbed in the interest of others in their group. Hence, you find it more difficult to make friends with them, which can occasionally be problematic for them because they can feel like an outsider. Additionally, he is frequently misunderstood by others. For example, some people may have just considered you to be awkward or shy. But your intelligent and inquisitive nature attracted you towards people who display more wisdom and intelligence than those in your age group. You like being alone. You continually seek out higher understanding and are incredibly introspective about life. You aren't materialistic. You don't drive a luxury car to work. You don't have the need to spend fortune or branded clothes. You don't take loans and you don't fancy the most expensive gadgets, especially smartphones. You understand that all these things are just a means to display one's shallowness and don't add to life's true essence in any manner. These are not the things that constitute life spiritually. Actually, they detach you from the true core of mankind. The past and the future lose control over you. You understand that the past and the future don't truly exist and the only moment that was is and will never be in the present. Inner strength. A mystic has great inner strength. He is no longer has a need for the power struggles that most of us engage in. The mystic has learned healthy ways of connecting with the source of mindfulness energy through healthy interaction with people and within. You are not self-centered. A mystic person is not self-centered. since he has lost the sense of a separate self he can see the interconnected nature of our existence to the mystic this is a reality and not just a concept moreover the mystic realizes that all physical manifestation depend on each other for their survival so are you related to these signs please let me know in the comment section below i hope you like this video thank you for watching